What's up guys? Welcome to the channel. Don't forget to smash that thumbs up if you like the uh, video. Don't forget to subscribe, it really helps us grow the channel. So what's this video all about? Well, this week, or last week, a tweet was posted. And it was in regards to Xbox Play Anywhere. Now at E3 they stated that that's going to be the flagship thing of the new Xbox. You know, we can buy a game and you can play it on Windows 10 anywhere, you can play it at work, you can play it on your tablet, you can do play it anywhere. Sounds amazing, right? Well, for everything that's always said, there's always something else that comes up and is completely bloody misleading. So, Gears of War tweeted that Xbox Play Anywhere purchased Gears of War 4 digitally to play on both Xbox One and Windows 10 at no additional cost. What does that mean? What that means to me is that I go out and I spend £200, which I've already done, on pre-ordering the Gears of War 4 Ultimate Collector's Edition, so that's the game, the Triforce Collector piece, and the Season Pass, which is 200 quid. and now I've got to go and spend another £50 to go on Xbox Live and download the game digitally in order for me to play that anywhere I want on a Windows 10 device, which is really frustrating and also quite upsetting people don't have this kind of money which everyone seems to think is just easily attainable nowadays so we all thought it would be too good to be true so it clearly obviously is but who knows you know we might see in the next few months then back track on it and give us the codes in the discs there was a statement that said that they couldn't do it they can't put the code with the discs because some licensing or something which is nonsense you know we I, I used to make music on, you know, on, on software and the key, the key was with the disc. It's nonsense to say the licenses can't be put with the keys. That's rubbish. You know, it could easily be put in the console, in the game box, and you know, it gives it up to the user to decide what, what they do with that license. It's not up to anyone else. It just ultimately seems like Microsoft has seen a way to make full profit. You know, they don't have to produce a disc. They don't have to ship a disc. They don't have to make a box. You know, it's an easy way for them to just make full profit. You know, bung that game on the marketplace, charge fifty pound. I mean, some of the games on the marketplace right now are ridiculously priced. Mortal Kombat X is one of them. They still want fifty pound for that game, and that you can go to your local game in the high street and buy that game for ten pound pre-owned. It's ridiculous, and it's just. Uh, what we all have Xboxes and we love them and we love the Gears of War franchise but when they do things like this it just makes you think what's the point you know you're just pushing customers away I really hope that it's not going to be the case you know there's me I could be ranting right now and saying that it needs to be changed and come Gears of War 4 we all get the codes in the in the boxes and that would be amazing you know that was the one big thing that we were looking forward to me and my partner playing Gears of War I could play it on my laptop she could play it on the screen you know we we don't do skip screen on Gears of War 4, 3 because it's um, Ultimate Edition because it's bloody awful. If they're going to do that on Gears of War 4 with the black bars down the side to keep the frame rate, then it's just they need to make sure that you know that's that's perfect or you know the, the whole code thing needs to be there. It's just not fair. You know it is what it is. It'd be interesting to see what happens. You know, be interested to see what you guys think. You know. I'm pretty sure we can uh, start a good rage off in the comment section. You know, and there's nothing worse than having these videos put on and no one talks in the comments. Let's have a good rage about it. You know, Twitter's always where the rage is, so let's keep it to YouTube. It'll be fun. So it'll be interesting to see what happens. So I might just be hitting you know, getting stressed out over nothing come the day, and then we all get our codes and everyone will be happy. But that'll be disappointing if I've got to spend that much money on that. I mean, the, the Elite controller as well. That's just too expensive and the Xbox One S price and the UK price and the US price is ridiculous you know it's just the way things are going unfortunately and hopefully they can uh, get it sorted out be a shame real shame if they don't get that sorted out I'll cry I will cry and Timmy will cry and Mini Marcus will cry and we'll all cry anyway enough about me whinging thanks for uh, watching the video don't forget thumbs up and subscribe and share and don't forget to comment really appreciate it and we'll see you soon